This segment of the Humane Society for Hamilton County brought to you by Invisible Fence and sponsored in part by the Milano Inn. Raymond is a basset hound. He's a purebred, isn't he? He looks to be. I believe so, yes. Okay. You got him. You're a foster right now. I am now. a foster. Okay. And he has some special challenges. What, what's, what was wrong with him when they gave him to him and said, help Anne, help us? Um, Raymond was recovering from some surgery that allowed him to swallow. When he came to me, he was significantly underweight um, and needed a home environment where he could have special food, special feedings four times a day. Um, Special care. Yeah. yeah. Just a lot of love, right? Absolutely. But he does bark once in a while like a basset hound would. Mm -hmm. What else can you tell me about... He's sitting on my foot. (laughs) (laughs) What else can you tell me about Raymond? Um, Raymond really is an awesome, awesome dog. Um, He he is very calm and he likes to get a lot of love. He loves other dogs, um, pretty much all other animals. You said you have chickens too. He I likes do. The chickens. Yeah, I have two <laughs> so chickens. Some chickens at home. Those yeah. would be a good dog for you. Um, yeah, he uh, checks where they are, but doesn't pester them or chase after them. Um, he is wonderful with children. Really interested in just people in general. Okay. Yes, he okay. needs a forever home, um, and he would be a really great dog for somebody who says, "I'd like another dog, but I'm not as active as I used to be." Okay. Um, he would be the ideal dog. You're for a little that. couch potato, huh? You little Dickens, you. Oh yes. Oh, he's a good boy. <laughs> Raymond came to us as a stray from Hamilton County. Somebody found him wandering the streets and brought him in to us. Mm-hmm. Um, it was mid to late July when he came in, and he was just a skinny boy, really sick, and not in good shape when we got him. So quickly found out he had trouble swallowing? Right, right. We knew that there was something wrong by how skinny he was, and he also drooled a lot. So we took him over to one of our vets, had some x-rays done, had to call some specialists in, and found out that he did actually have trouble swallowing. His muscles wouldn't allow him to swallow Went to food. Purdue, didn't he? He did go to Purdue. Um, mm-hmm. They were very generous, and they were able to help us out with the cost by getting him some teaching grants to help him because his condition is so rare. Someone sees Raymond and they go, i got to have him. What, what do they have to do? They would have to come into the shelter okay. or they could complete an adoption application online on our website at www.hamiltonhumane.com okay. um, and they can send that in or bring it in and then we would make arrangements for his foster mom to bring him in and introduce him at the shelter. Right. Well, he's a very sweet boy. He is a sweet I boy. Love... Somebody's going to be lucky Aww. to have him. Yes, and those big ears. I love big boys with big ears. He's so cute. So. 